Hey, how's it going guys? Union Jack here, bringing you guys another Call of Duty Infinite Warfare video. In today's video, I've got some really, really good news for all of you fans that hated trade killing. So trade kill medals were introduced to Call of Duty around a month or two ago and basically it allows players to trade kills so you could essentially kill each other. Everyone, nobody liked this, absolutely nobody liked this. It's kind of made hardcore unplayable and like infected. It's like I, I kill them and they knife me and it's like a trade kill. It's so stupid so I'm so glad it's gone. There's also been some other patches so Genesis is now back in rotation kind of dropped off the rotation for some reason. Capture the flag has been removed from Infinite Warfare. That's quite interesting that one. I mean I didn't play Capture the Flag but I think it was in the special playlist anyway. Also Epic Gun Game has been added so I think that's Epic Variants only and that will last until the 21st of July. Um, also the Hailstorm and Audience Akimba Rate of Fire has been reduced. Also the M2187 uh, fixed issues with some challenges not working as intended. Uh, we've also got uplink fixed for an issue where the drone could fall between the haystacks outside of the barn and force a time out on throwback. Uh, I didn't play um, uplink, but I guess a lot of competitive players use that strategy. Um, the Proteus Trek 50 and M2187 uh, has been added to gun game and epic gun game, which is quite interesting. Uh, and we've got one more fix for players being able to use the secondary modes on hybrid weapons like the Type 2, RPR Evo and the EBR 800 in the competitive playlist. Also there's been a couple of various map fixes that haven't been stated in the patch notes. Also attack of the radioactive thing, Pack-a-Punch Axe now tracks progress correctly for bounties, traps now correctly track progress for bounties, charge fuses can now be turned in while holding an upgraded weapon and also various weapon bug fixes proteus and volk for zombies so guys that is it for the patch notes if you did find this video uh, of any help or if you found it informational make sure you give this video a massive thumbs up also subscribe to my channel for more call of duty videos and i'll see you in the next one peace out